as one of the richest textile heritages in the world, which dates back to the dawn of civilization. Times have changed, but the tradition of excellence continues. Today, India is home to a modern, vibrant and growing hand-woven textile industry. The handloom sector of the country is one of the largest sectors comprising of unorganized economic activities and it constitutes an integral part of the rural and semi-rural livelihood engaging over 3.5 million people. Textile sector of India has seen large participation of women in rural India. The art of handloom weaving thrives across the north, south, east and west of the country, producing innumerable and unique varieties of products. A wide variety of products suitable to the varying consumer tastes and preferences both within the country and overseas. Some examples of the exquisite transformation of art onto fabric by the adept weavers of the country are Kanchipuram of Tamil Nadu, Balacheri and Jamdani of West Bengal, Paitani of Maharashtra, Chanderi and Maheshwari of Madhya Pradesh. Muga of Assam, Patola of Gujarat, Kani and Shatosh of Kashmir, Tai and Dai Vichitrapuri and Bomke of Odisha, Bandini of Rajasthan, Brocades of Varanasi. Balarampuram of Kerala, Pochampalli Ikat of Andhra Pradesh, etc. The socio economic importance of the handloom industry has led to its identification as one of the priority sectors of the country. The Honorable Prime Minister of India had declared the 7th of August as National Handloom Day at a function held in Chennai in 2015. He had also launched the India Handloom brand to amplify awareness about the exemplary advantages of using Indian handloom products including their quality with regard to raw materials, processing, weaving and also the enviro-friendly feature of handloom output. India is the only country which produces handlooms on a commercial scale. India is the only country in the global trade having a sizable quantum of exports of hand-woven products despite severe competition not only from the competing countries but also from mechanized sector within the country. The major handloom export centers are Karur, Panipet, Varanasi, Kannur, etc. The main product categories exported are home textiles including bed linen, table linen, toilet linen and kitchen linen, towels, curtains, floor coverings, clothing accessories, stoves, scarves and fabric, saris, fashion fabrics. Handloom product exports are actively happening and has been hovering around 350 million US dollars of which carpets and floor coverings contribute 49%, made ups 40%, fabrics 7% and clothing accessories 4%. Indian handwoven products are exported largely to USA and EU countries. Handloom Export Promotion Council 
known as HEPC under the aegis of Development Commissioner for Handlooms, Ministry of Textiles, Government of India was constituted in the year 1965 to promote export of handloom products from India. Presently, HEPC has about 1,500 member exporters spread across the country. The primary objective of HEPC is to support handloom exporters, mainly assisting and providing the required support and guidance to the exporters for trade promotion and international marketing. HEPC, which has its headquarters in Chennai, also has a regional office in New Delhi and liaison offices in Karur, Panipet and Gawati. In its endeavor to promote export of hand-woven products from India, HEPC organizes participation in around 20 international events across the globe every year. Besides, it also organizes reverse buyer-seller meets in India, hosting overseas trade visitors from all over the world. HEPC arranges trade delegations and organizes buyer-seller meets abroad. HEPC also organizes virtual events in coordination with Indian missions abroad. HEPC acts as a liaison body between government and industry and provide policy inputs to ministry. HEPC also organizes seminars in major export centers to disseminate information on latest trends, recent trade updates, export knowledge, etc. Training sessions are organized for members for upskilling and it also undertakes field visits to facilitate the trade. HEPC has been taking every possible step to provide market support and market access opportunities to its member exporters through the above activities. HEPC acts as an interface between international buyers and Indian exporters by undertaking various activities that serve their interests. Indian textile sector has immense inherent strength to make our handloom tradition the focal point of fashion for the country and the world. My Handloom, My Pride